hello everyone hope you are doing well so in my previous video we have seen that uh, how we can release an order how we can edit its uh, promise date and how we can cancel it we have performed all these actions on a single order item so in this video we will be performing release update and cancellation on bulk orders so just select a few order item and uh, I will be clicking on release button as we can see that we have called uh, upload JSON file endpoint with post method and uh, we have uploaded a binary file in that along with a config ID this so to release the order item in bulk you will need to call this endpoint this endpoint with post method and this as config id so let's just test this in postman just select the post method and here in authorization let's set the basic auth now in body i want form data so from here i will be taking the name of the file as uploaded file and it's a file i already have created a file release items dot json i have created a json file the next thing will be passing the config id i will show how, what i have stored in my json file So this is my json file and this is the data these are the bulk orders if you remember my previous video i have passed these parameters only as my payload but i only have passed for one item in this video we are we are talking about bulk orders so i have passed two orders uh, for release so after this So as we can see that our order has been uh, put for release, we have uh, upload file content ID has been generated and it has been stored in data manager. Can this is config ID and uh, and a successful message is also generated. So this is the way for releasing the bulk orders using the upload JSON file endpoint and config ID. Similarly for update promise date and cancel orders we also have to perform this procedure only. Select some orders. So this is the endpoint upload JSON file and here the config ID is this. The endpoint is uh, similar just the config ID uh, is different in all the three cases. Select the authorization.
then body select form data we have to create key value pairs so in key just write this file key and select its type to as I have created the JSON file for release I also have created for updated and cancel orders as well As we were getting the uh, response of release, the similar response is for the update orders as well. An upload file content ID is generated, then uh, the file path and config ID and an upload message. After that, we will be seeing about how to cancel bulk orders. The items has been queued for uh, for cancel. I will also be showing how I have created the JSON file for this. The process will be same. file option was not coming so I will just repeat the whole process again The process was uh, I didn't have selected the form data I was doing on none that's why the file option was not coming
so as we can see that we also have cancelled bulk orders so this is the way of basically a release bulk orders update bulk orders and cancel bulk orders individually we have done them with the help of some endpoints like release order item update order item and cancel order item but in bulk we have performed that by help of upload uploading a json file which contains the data that we want to release order sorry update or cancel so next uh, let's just see how i have created the json file uh just click on view source over here this is the data that i have just refresh it and uh, freshly i will be showing this two orders i have selected for release view source these are the two orders these are the orders and keep the file name this so in this way i had created my json files which were, which we want to upload so this was the way for a release update and cancel individual orders and also the bulk orders hope you like this video thank you so much for watching this video